Okay. Hello once again. I'm back again in this house working on another project. Uh, house, as, I, as I said before, is pretty much done. I had an inspection, um, Chicago housing inspection, and everything passed except one thing. Once an inspector caught it, and it's a good thing he did because this particular window here, uh, it opens fine, but it won't stay open. Slam shut. <clears throat> Imagine someone had their hands in there. You could break some fingers. So in order to fix this, these old-fashioned uh, window sashes had uh, a, a rope and weight system. A rope goes up in here and goes back behind this window jam, and one over here as well. And the weight kept the window from slamming down. It actually held the window still. So I'll show you maybe another window that has it already in there so you can get an idea of what I got to do. And once again, these aren't teaching videos. I'm just showing you the work that I need to do in order to get this house done. See how this has a rope and rope on this side too. And it goes down in there. So I got to get in there. The first thing I'm going to do is begin to take off the, I think they call this, uh, I don't know all the parts of a window. I used to know them all, but I know this is the sash. I think this is the stop. This keeps the sash in place. So I got to take this stop off to be able to get in there. And it looks like what I got to do is fish a rope through here. I'm going to use a polyester rope. It's cheaper. I get it for 17 cent per foot, a linear foot. Uh, I know cotton is the probably a better one, but I heard polyester will work just fine. But don't use vinyl. I did a little research on it. Vinyl would gum up, and it's too too much elastic in it, I guess. Uh, but yeah, so that's the job for today. And like I said again, I'm just going to show you a few steps as I go about doing this. The first time me actually working with these type of windows, changing out the the, the ropes and the weights, and it'd be a new new experience for me to gain. But again, these are not teaching videos. None of my videos are teaching videos. This is just a video blog to show my friends and family how things are going in this old house. Okay, thanks for watching. Enjoy the video. Okay, well, what I've done now is uh, got the the stops loose. And pull the little piece of my call it the board that was right here, and inside there, you can see our weights. Here's the other one on this side. You can see it better. And there's the broken rope. I'm going to be using a cotton rope. Uh, I did a little more research and found out that these ropes will last a long time, and they're better. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be running out, fishing a rope up through and come out of here and then reattach it to the sash, which is right here. Uh, these are kind of tough to get out. Let me show you. These fit right in there like that. And they were not easy to come out. You had to unscrew them and then they were had to work with it back and forth to wiggle it out. But eventually you'll get it. But uh, yeah, this is uh, coming along pretty good. Uh, next video I'll show you will be it have uh, the ropes attached to the weights. There's a weight that I took loose out of this pocket here. The trick to all this is to make sure that the weights are properly positioned. And the rope is just the right length. You don't want to have too much slack, you make too much noise, and you don't want to have it too short where it don't work properly. So. All right, so what I've done now, I've attached the ropes to the sash and the rope other end to the weight. And I've installed the sash back into the window. You can see in here, I don't know if I can, there is the rope here. New knot tied to the weight. Got it on both ends, and I do a little test to see that the window stays open. Doesn't 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 slam shit. And there's the ropes there going into the little pulleys. So 
Now all I gotta do now is reattach the block that goes here, there, over there, and then it stops. And then this one will be done. And now of course I had to repaint some pieces because you got chipping paint. Can't have no chipping paint. Else you can't pass the inspection. Thanks for watching.